my hair, damn, I just woke up. Well, I didn't wake up. I woke up a while ago. But <laughs> and I watched the Nets game. Kyrie Irving, first game back, he started. I did not think he was going to start, but he started. First off, before we start today's video, what do you guys think of Kyrie Irving returning to the starting lineup? How do you think it'll go for the team and what success will bring? I mean, this is what they needed because when they originally signed Patty Mills and Marcus Aldridge, they wanted them to come off the bench like they did tonight. That was what they were envisioning to be like co-six mans, okay? And now that they're back, it's going to be great. So I want to hear your thoughts down below, guys. What do you guys think of the Brooklyn Nets? Like and subscribe to help the channel grow and, you know, Watch the end of the video for more watch time. Either way, I don't know why I said that weird. Let's talk about this game. Let's talk about Kyrie Irving's impact. He, You can tell shooting-wise, I mean, he was 9 for 17, which is great for the field, but he was 0 for 2. And it looks like shooting. He isn't that far off from being back to his 100% self. Means he was just training a lot. Looks like he was in shape. He does look a little skinny. I will admit. I was looking at Kyrie. I was like, Kyrie doesn't look much bigger than me. Like Kyrie, I honestly think I could hold hold up in a fight with Kyrie. I think if I had to, if my life depended on it, I think I'd still die. But like, I think I'd go a lot longer than most people would think. But Kyrie, he went out there at four assists, three steals and a block. I think the defensive effort by Kyrie was the more impressive part. He was just pick a pocketing and he was setting his teammates up. But what was cool about Kyrie was his shot selection. When I was watching this game, I was just looking at Kyrie moving around the floor. And I was just like, all right, Kyrie. He he went out there, Kevin Durant assisted him uh, a few times. But he had like a running floater and then he had a, a few shots inside. And he was taking everything. He had some mid ranges where Nick Claxton hit him, then another floater around the, you know, or, you know, running pull up jump, you could say, around the free throw line. Then he had another mid range. Then he had a shot that they counted as a two pointer. I thought it was a three pointer that Patty Mills assisted it on. It was good to see Kyrie out there having the success that we've been wanting, okay? It was just that, like, hey, it felt like, it really did feel like forever that Kyrie was like everyone was just doubting Kyrie they were saying like he ain't gonna be the same he ain't gonna you know be able to do anything but I think he came out here and was just like hey I'm actually in shape like ready to play and I don't think anybody in reality was thinking sorry I was looking down at some stats and I think when they come back like tonight they played James Johnson Patty Mills LaMarcus Aldridge Blake Griffin and DeAndre Bembry all off the bench. Really, Blake Griffin and James Johnson weren't the main guys. It was LaMarcus Aldridge and DeAndre Bembry and Patty Mills. Well, and those guys are going to be the three guys off the bench. And they moved David Duke to the starting lineup tonight. Okay? And that was interesting because I did not expect David Duke to be going out there. But, guys, I really do want to say this team is good. And now that Kyrie is back, their bench is going to be good. And they still have those rookies who were balling out for them. It was on. Honestly, this team is lethal, and I think that's going to be one of the best parts about it is seeing the success they're about to have when postseason comes or when this team really just gets fully healthy because I think that's that's going to be the interesting part, okay? When this team is fully healthy, Joe Harris comes back, okay, and they're going out there splashing threes, and really defensively, I think this team is way better than where they were last year on defense. Like, they're a pretty damn good team at playing defense. They play the perimeter good, and they have a rim protector. And Nick Claxton, you know, Kevin Durant does a good job at blocking shots, but Nick Claxton, James Johnson, I wouldn't say Blake Griffin's a rim protector. LaMarcus Aldridge can do that. Then they have so many def perimeter defenders and DeAndre Bembry, okay, David Duke, you know, James Harden, Kem Durant, when they try, they're good defenders. Right? Bruce Brown, Javon Carter. Like, I think he was awesome. And this is a team that I think is going to be good. And I think Kyrie Irving, the like Kyrie Irving's season debut was awesome. Okay. And I expect great things from him. And yeah, like, why not okay 
why not is this team i think this team really is the team that could win the championship like why wouldn't they they have like the, i think one of the most complete rosters in the nba and that's why they'll probably end up being nba champs this year because scoring wise they have the stars defensively they have the guys and they're to me, there isn't really that many weaknesses on this team, okay? So I want to hear your thoughts down below.